How's it going, guys? I'm Oz, and welcome back to another episode of Ozzy's Mailbag with Oz. Okay, so you're probably aware that uh, my bird is actually a girl, not a boy. Now, after this egg bound laying incident happened, um, we needed to move. So, the reason why it happened was she got all broody and stuff because. Matthew's parents actually have a cockatiel as well and he kept calling to her when we were living together so they were in the living room together. So after this, to, event, to avoid this happening again where she wants to lay eggs and all this sort of thing, we had to move her into our room. Now we could only fit her in our room if one of the computers went and needless to say that had to be mine. So that's why I haven't been recording at all for the last several months be quite honest because we've had our bird in there instead so with that note it's the reason why you haven't seen an episode I was hoping to do these more often as mail kept coming in but without a computer I couldn't record so um, we have a lot of parcels here and envelopes um, that have been waiting quite honestly for at least seven months to be opened so I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for sending me mail if you guys want to send if anyone else wants to send me mail because we so seriously grown a lot since the last time you know I announced that I had a PO box and all this sort of thing. So if you want my PO box address, it'll be in the comment section below. Find that, send me a letter. My requirements are that you send me a letter as well as a photo of you so I have an idea of what you look like. It's not that I'm building my own database for world domination. I promise you it's not that. <laughs> so um, that's my only requirement. If you want to send me gifts or anything like that, that's fine. Look, a letter is honestly perfectly fine. I understand freighting to Australia is ridiculous. So, without further ado, we've got some goodies. And I'm very, very, very excited. I think we'll start off with the letters first. Um, see, I'm just dying to read them. So, first up, this one says to the girl from Oz. I think this is actually from Australia, which is kind of cool. And it has a little meow. On the back, I think that, I thought that was rather cute. I mean, dying to see what this was. So, this is seriously a momentous day. I've been honestly waiting way, way, way too long. Ooh, to open these. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Oh, dear Oz, I want to say thank you for streaming so much over the past two and a half years even though I haven't really been streaming much at all. Um, I have been through hell and back. Seeing you so excited and happy helped me get through that. Thanks for everything, Courtney. Yellow submarine. Oh, you beautiful girl. I already know what you look like and you are stunning. Courtney wants to be a model. Well, she is a model. What am I talking about? But she's absolutely beautiful. And she drew a little picture. I'm very jealous. That is so cute. Thank you so much. And, and, and. I think... Is this for an iPhone 4 or an iPhone 5? But she sent me an iPhone case with Ellie and Joel. My iPhone case only just broke the other day. Oh, look at that. Yes. I can you remember me. Yes. Thank you so much, Courtney. That is brilliant. I love it. I will actually use it. And hopefully I won't break it. But I'm sorry if I do. Because I'm gonna use it. I love it. Thank you. Man, I can't believe I've had a letter. Like, I'm. It's a wonder that you haven't said anything before. Like, hey, maybe you did, and I just forgot. Anyway, I'm, I'm sorry. Thank you. This one is another one. You hear that? I'm hoping that it's foreign currency. I love. If it, if you can send me anything, foreign currency. I love it. I know it costs money. Duh. So I only make it small things, but I love it. It's really to see. It's really surreal to see stuff from another country because you kind of forget about the world when you're all the way in Tassie. Okay. Righto. So this one looks like it's from. It must be from Mum. Ingerand. Okay. What is that? Hey Oz, or Dinny, beautiful name by the way, oh thank you, my name is J or CJ, Callistus J, Callistus J, we'll name me CJ, 
I really wanted to send you a letter because you've been an imp such an important part of my life and honestly I don't know where I'd be without you. <laughs> so I first off wanted to say that you are funny and sweet and so genuine and just plain awesome and I'm also glad, I'm so glad you decided to share your amazing self with so many people around the world. Not intentionally but... <laughs> Um, secondly, I'm from England. Oh, what a good guess. And I put in some English pennies and stuff in the envelope. So, yay! I really wanted to give you some more money, but I just turned 16, so kind of low on my... It's, it's fine. Seriously, it's fine. Thirdly, shit gets real. I don't want this to be all serious and stuff, but I feel like I really need to share something with you because, as said, you're such an important part of my life. Um, I won't say this next bit. I can't really say too much more with the letter because um, it's kind of personal and everything. But basically the gist of it is CJ was having a tough time and um, watching me made a difference and that's absolutely beautiful. I'm really sorry to hear what happened in the past and everything but I'm glad that your future is looking so much more brighter and even if I played just a small part in all of that, I, that really... That really makes me feel so good. I'm so glad that, you know, I was able to help you in some way. Not intentionally, but I'm glad that some part of me was there for you. And I want to know, want you to know now that I am there for you, even though. <laughs> but yeah. On the end it says, P.S. I wish you the best future and hope that your house ends up being everything you want it to be. And it is. And look, he drew me shiny. Gotta get those shinies. So it says to look inside this. I don't want to rip. Hang on, where's my scissors? What is inside there, CJ? I feel so terrible that it's been so long. Oh, I see. So it was the coins that were inside them, but they've fallen out. I thought there was something else in there. So, this is a 50 pence coin. Here we go again with this sort of crap. So this is the queen with 50 pence with... I don't know what that's supposed to be on the front. It looks like someone from Greece, Athens. <laughs> Alright, a 10 pence. Which is kind of cool. Oh. It's got a little line and stuff on it. And a new pence. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Send some pence. So that one has some sort of sigil thing on there. Like a flirt at least. Not quite. Like that. Thank you so much, CJ. Again, thank you so much. And I'm so glad that everything's working out for you, as it should be. As it should be. I've got plans for all of these coins that um, you guys are sending me. So I'll keep you posted on that. Probably a few, a few weeks before I organise what I want to do with them. But um, it's going to be good. I can't wait. So this one is from all the way from Costa Rica, apparently. Ooh. Again, I can't... Like, unfortunately, those two, I mean, it's fair enough for Courtney, because I already know what she looks like. 
Would have been nice for a photo. I like to know who I'm, you know, talking to. Well, you know. Okay. I like how it's in brackets. Sorry for my English. It's okay. Hi, my name is Kevin. I'm 16 years old. I'm from the tiny country of Costa Rica. And I just want to congratulate you for having such a great channel. It's always a good... It's always a good new when good new when you upload maybe it's just good when you upload a new video also it's great to have more women playing uh, having present presence in the industry this helps debunking foolish stereotypes like only guys play video games obviously fake 40% of games are females oh. 48% of gamers are females. I don't think it's that high, but it'd be pretty cool if it was. I think my favourite videos are the Telltale Games playthroughs, yeah, and the Bioshock ones. Ah, I need to get back into Bioshock, because I, I did like the Infinite series, and I actually played Bioshock Infinite when um, I was on hiatus on console. My god, how does anyone play console games? It's ridiculously insane. I made something for you, but you need your PC to see what it is. So go to your browser, Read the description. Oh. I have to end this letter because I have psychology and physics test tomorrow and I have to study. Bye. Thank you so much, Kevin. I need to look up what you've sent to me. So. Unfortunately, I can't quite... I think you've done something, obviously, on here. But I can't quite see what you've done because it's not quite, link, like, working properly. If you can... Tweet it to me, or Facebook me the link, or even just put it in the um, comment section below. That would be really, really, really appreciated because I'm not quite coming up with your link. It keeps saying my computer's having a problem with it and I can't see it. But I really want to see it, so please, can you put it, um, Kevin, can you please, please, please put it in the thing and I'll be sure to definitely check it out. Um, so I'm really looking forward to hearing from you. Now, the next one. This one looks like it's from England again. You guys really love me in England. I feel so special over there. Like, it's really, really cool. Now, I just, just do a nip, nick in the corner here. So I would really, really honestly hate to, because it says something about paper. Wow. This is cool. Oh, this is really cool. Okay, so dear Dinny and Matt, and I love how you spelled my name right. It's only one N, not two. I hope you, both of you, had a nice Christmas and New Year. Guys, how old is this? Um, sorry this gift and letter set is so late in coming. That's Fine, I'm sorry, it took me so long to read it. That's bad. My name is Stuart. Um, I'm 27 years old, a qualified pool lifeguard and fitness trainer. 11 years to achieve. That's so cool. Sorry that this was the first gift is such a small one. But it's because the board still needs a little more work yet. Oh. Cool. So, anyway. Stuart, okay. My last four years have not been good, but your vids have been a pure delight. So thanks, Dinny, and thanks as well to Matt for helping you to make such an amazing channel. Thanks, mate. I just thought that I'd send you these so you know some of my hobbies and likes. P.S. These have been completely self-made and created. So this looks like this must be your house, Stuart. And then this must be you yourself. I love it when you guys send me photos because there's not it bugs me that I don't know what you look like. That's fantastic. Lifeguards are amazing people. So you must be 
from Bulgaria. I used to live in Bulgaria from May 2009 to 2010 for the best time of my life because people... Life was so much better as the picture show. He's made like this little booklet about Bulgaria and stuff and like the weather and the lifestyle. Like more pictures. It's really surreal for me because I haven't experienced or seen a lot of, you know, this sort of thing. It's just... Oh, Stuart, thank you so much. I'll read over it properly later on. But that's so cool. I really appreciate the time and effort that you've put into this. It's, it's absolutely amazing. And even like the con con um, conservation. Squirrels. Do, do Americans actually eat squirrels? I heard a rumor the other day that you guys eat squirrels. They're such cute little creatures. And oh, the otter. This is so cool. The cats. Blackbrook Zoological Park. Dude, this looks amazing. I love receiving stuff like this and like the subway map that I got. I can't remember what your name was, but the New York subway map and all this sort of thing. Like, it's really, really cool. It just makes me connect with other countries in a way that, you know, I wouldn't normally, like, I wouldn't just randomly look up stuff on Bulgaria. But it makes me interested even more because of the fact that that's you. That's a piece of you in there. It's cool. I'll, I'll read through it probably more later on when I show Matthew all this stuff. Okay, next one. So this looks like it's from all the way from the United States. Okay, when was this sent? June, June 12th. Oops. Sorry. Maybe you guys should start dating the letters so then it makes me feel even worse. And then I'd actually start, you know, doing these a bit more often. Sorry. Okay. Right. Why do you guys have to make this password opening so hard? Okay. Now this looks like it's from two people. Alexa, Alexa, Alex, <laughs> and Julia. Julia? Yeah. Okay. We got there. What in the world? Oh, wow! I need to open this. I hope I got a letter from you guys. You've taped it all around, so it's like cutting on. I'm getting there. Okay. Hey, Oz, it's me, Lexi. So I. Oh, Lexi, not Alex, sorry. Um, this second note is. Sorry, second note, hang on. I think I've had a little. 
Hang on, bear with me. Bear with me here, I'm sorry. Oh, God, I'm trying not to rip it, but I just want to... Okay, here we go. Hi, my name is Lexi and I'm 13 years old. I live in America I live in America and I'm American. I already talked to you one time on Facebook. I don't know if you remember, but I was super happy when you did respond. Most people are surprisingly enough. It's pretty cool. I didn't know what to say and I was shocked you even replied. I, I try. It takes a long time, but I try. I always do research on YouTubers if they have a Facebook. I'm glad most of them do, but I either can't send a message or they don't respond. But when I got a message from you, my heart fell. I was so filled with joy. I stayed up for, I stayed up one night for three hours stuck on your YouTube channel because I didn't want to stop watching your amazing com content. I woke up at 2 a.m. and fell back asleep at 5. I have spent almost 30 hours watching your content because you're amazing. I truly love you and your playthroughs. There is not a day passes I don't watch your content. I've watched the entire Last of Us playthrough and I'm on the ninth episode of The Walking Dead. I do appreciate all the hard work you put into your videos and I bet every person in our community does. Oh, I love how you said our community. It's fantastic. I get how you're making a new house with Matt and I get that some people are giving you a hard time. But screw them. <laughs> they don't know anything about how to be patient. I mean, you have a lot on your chest and these people need to back off. You're 13 years old and you're so... <sighs> abrupt, but it's so cool. I know you will be back in July. <laughs> I can't wait for you to come back. But I also can't wait for you to start off the Mass Effect series. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I will do those. I also got you these two boxes of Pocky. I won't tell you what Pocky is. But I would really like it when you come back to use them in your next um, food taste vi test video. I don't know if they have Pocky in Australia, but here you go. Hi, my name is Julia. I'm 10. I'm Lexi's youngest sister. And when you replied to Lexi on Facebook and she mentioned about writing a paper to you, I just got so excited. I know you're in... I know you're in Australia and I'm America, so I know this letter won't get to you for a long time. So I really hope um, you do. Uh, and I've been watching you for about a month now. And... My real name is Alexia. Uh, so there's, Alex there's Lexi. I think it's Alexia. Yeah. How? Okay, so so this is back to Lexi again. It's a bit um, disjointed, but it's great. I love playing The Last of Us. Completed the game three times. Um, I'm at the part where we meet the fireflies. I've also played The Walking Dead on my third episode. I also get shit from other guy gamers or just guys in general, but I'm used to it. It's terrible that you have to say that, but yeah, you do get used to it. Shit, shit. It's kind of bad to say that, but I'm used to it. <laughs> I just said the same thing that you said that. Um, yeah. I do love watching your videos and you make me smile every time you smile. And you bring joy to my day every day. Um... I bet most of us love your channel and most of them know what you're, that you're getting a new house and I'm fine with waiting. I do love watching your content, like I've said so many times, and I always like watching the video, yeah. My phone died and I just started crying because my brother was on the computer so I couldn't watch your video. I know it's close to your birthday, this might get there on time, but if not, but anyways, happy early late slash birthday. Oh, th thank you so much guys. I think you should turn this around. <gasps> Ooh. They said, congratulations on 22,000 subscribers. Thank you so much. Want to say here is a PS... Um, and she's attached a PS3 game with it. And I'll show that in a moment. But look at the cute little penguin that they drew. Isn't it beautiful? I love penguins. And so this one here, you 
Mum said we can't bring cookies. They wanted to send me cookies, but then Mum told them not. Hey, Mum, how are you? Thank you so much for letting them send a letter to me. And look, it's... I don't have the ponytail anymore, but... The... Ah! Look, there's a Walking Dead one, made by Julia. Dude, you can draw so much better than what I can. How cool is that? So, I hope you don't mind me showing this, Mum. But, these are the girls here. And you guys are just beautiful. Thank you so much for sending it. So, they sent me Call of Duty. So, it'd be interesting to see if it actually works um, over here. It should do. Call of Duty, I actually... Um, if I be brutally honest, I don't like the series and I don't want to promote it. But um, if the only one that I've ever liked in the series is actually World at War. So if I'm to receive a Call of Duty, I'm quite happy to receive this one. But please, I beg you, don't send me the other ones because it's just a waste of time. And I'll probably upload a clip of me burning it because I really don't like the franchise. Apart from this game, I actually like this game. When Matt and I first met, this is the game that we played. So um, I, I'm kind of nostalgic about it. But... I would definitely play this, um, I might actually play it on a live stream. Yeah, because I, I like the zombie game in it. I think it's this one, isn't it? That's got the zombie one in it. Can't remember. But the co-op is really good. And I used to play this, um, at a local gaming place as well. So, yeah. Thank you so much. And, yes, I got money. And, Mum, I just... I, it's really quite amazing, especially, like, I feel really amazed about this one because of the fact that, obviously, you know, the kids so young, they would obviously have to get their parents to, um, send me. They, the parents would have organised to actually send this to me. So, Mum, thank you so much for taking the time and actually letting these girls send it to me because it honestly really does mean the world to me. I, and that you've allowed them to do this is it's really 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 cool so it looks like look I've got one dollar bills this this is a crazy concept this is quite honestly the worthless piece of money like why would you have a one dollar note like it just it's so strange, but it is really honestly so cool. Thank you so much. But the concept of having a $1 bill is just the strangest thing in the world. And if it's, is it true that if you put these through the washing machine, that's it? They turn into like tissues? That is, I, I've got a one. And it looks like mum's taken the time and sent me these little coins. So I've got a dime. I'm sure you guys know, know what a dime looks like. And I've got... A Mississippi? What is that? Oh, a quarter. Quarter of a dollar, 25 cents. So I've got a quarter. I've got two quarters. Oh, no, that's not a quarter. That's. Oh, no, it is a quarter. So it's a different kind of quarter. Like a different picture on the front. And then I've got. Is this a penny? One cent. It's a quarter dollar as well, but with an eagle on it. This is really bad. I'll put a picture on my face of my Facebook, my Twitter, that's linked to my Facebook. And then there's another quarter. Oh, this is so cool. And five cents. That's not right. That is really, 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 really cool. I can't believe this has been sitting around in my thing for so long. And, and, they sent me po- Oh, I know what pockies are. Can I still eat them though? Yeah. They're sticks that are dipped in like... Thing bobs. I've never actually had them before. <laughs> Keep in a cool and dry place before, below 82 degrees Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit, how weird. And I like how your, um... Packaging like the saturated fats and everything content. It's all clearly labeled out and everything 
but it doesn't have oh before August this year but these ones aren't due until January maybe I'll give these ones to Matthew and I'll eat these ones <laughs> is that a valuable best buy it could still be good I will definitely eat some of those in my next um, foreign food thing along with a peanut butter and jelly sandwich Ugh. last but not least oh goodness me now I believe this is from Jean Jean? I think it's Jean thank you so much Lexi and thank you so much Julia for taking the time and thank you mum for letting them send that to me I really 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 appreciate it thank you okay last but not least because I gotta go to bed Um, and then this way as well, and this way as well. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. That's a shame. This has been, this class has been sitting in my house for a very, very, very long time. Like, I'm talking really early this year. So there's actually, Jean's told me not to eat this snack anymore and I won't. It's like a pancake sort of thing. And they're really hard. Pancake. Egg. Red bean. Mmm. What the hell is it? I have to look it up. I don't know if I would have been game enough to eat one of those. If you send it again, I'll try it out. But they scare me a little bit. It's a bit weird. I don't you don't see anything like that in our stores. It's weird. Oh, come on. Please open. Please open. I'm pretty sure this is Jean. I'm not ruining the address. There we go. Oh. Definitely, Jean. There we go. Hi, Oz. It's been a long time since I last saw your videos. I think I speak on behalf of your loyal viewers that we all miss you very much. It is good to see that your new house is almost done. Please send my regards to Matt and Lemon, though, for though we never met, they still feel like a part of this community. It almost did not occur to me that Australia is, in fact, summer right now. God, you must have sent this to me last year. Oh my God while now we are freezing our butt off in Hong Kong. To give a brief account of what happened during the absence, Hong Kong went through its biggest large-scale protest in history. Students marched onto the street and occupied the government building for over three months. I remember that now. The police mobilized tear gas and press from all over the world c came over um, to cover the event. Remember what I said about Hong Kong's population density Comparing to a Tasmania, yes. Imagine the city in chaos for that long. I wish I had more time to join your Twitch live stream these days, but I'm very busy at this moment. Anyway, I've spent sent a pack of snack to you. It's called Dora Yaki, a traditional Japanese snack that's quite common when I was a child in Taiwan. Taiwan used to be a Japanese colony. I think you will like it. Best gene. Telltale Game of Thrones is awesome. Ah, not a hint or anything. And there's um, a picture of me. He's very good at drawing. I love him. And, and. Oh, this is from the Silent Hill. This is fantastic. What the fuck is that? Can you remember? What the fuck is that? Oh, that is fantastic. I need to get these things laminated. Thank you so much, Jean, so much for that. And I'm sorry I didn't get to eat them. I'm really not game enough to try them now though because, um, yeah, I might get food poisoning. Mm. Thanks again to all of you that um, send, like, took the time to actually send me mail. Um, again, if you want to send me anything, please look in the comment section. That's where you'll have my address. Um, just a letter is honestly perfectly fine and a photo of yourself, please. I really like to see what you guys look like. Get an idea of 
Yes. And I'll try to organize some sort of folder to put these things in because now I'm actually starting to get a collection, which is pretty freaking cool. So until next time, guys, um, take care. And I really, really look forward to um, hearing from you soon. Thank you. Bye.